Let me set the scene for you. It's 1999, you put that fresh CD into your PlayStation and you turn on Gran Turismo. And what's one of the first cars you buy on that game? This. But anyway, cue the Gran Turismo clip. Yes, now the nostalgia's out of the way. In for braking this week is this Mitsubishi F20. And a lovely example in white with the original wheels. It's a great car, this. It is showing some spots of rust on the roof. All the panels on it are absolutely sound. Let's have a look under that bonnet. That's right. It's even got the 24 valve V6 in this as well. Double overhead cams. I loved Japanese cars from the late 90s. They were just phenomenal. And this was one of those rare birds. It really was. And again, I'll refer back to Gran Turismo because, you know, 90s nostalgia. I even like the fact that also like the Subarus and Mitsubishis of the time, predominantly, they have a nice Momo steering wheel on it. This one even having the Mitsubishi emblem on it with the Momo logo. But there's a nice one there. There's even a six and a half inch widescreen stereo in this, so you can have that out of the breakers as well. And I like the Japanese center consoles on these. They've got your clocks, even a voltage gauge on this, does show that this has got a bit of sporting pedigree. So yeah, a nice little Japanese 90s nostalgic look back today. And I suppose it's time to cue the music. It's time for some more Gran Turismo. <laughs> A really nice manual box in this as well. Five on the floor with reverse. That lovely, sweet V6 engine. Those classic Mitsubishi alloys on it. Everything about this car is an absolutely great buy. So if you want to keep your FTO on the road, you just need to quote 577851. Speak to our telesales staff and see if you can get some reclaimed parts bargains off of this 90s Japanese warrior.